Good morning, Westfield High School. Today is Friday, April 14th, 2023. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, WHS, and welcome back to BDTV. I'm Enrique Ruiz. And I'm Eddie Davenport. Prom 2023 tickets have been extended through April 20th. Full tables, partial tables, and singles are all welcome to attend. Please check your grade's Google Classroom page for more information and forms. The Cutting with a Cause Club will be having a meeting today after school in room 131. The Speaking Out Initiative invites you for a safety and self-defense seminar on Friday, April 21st, immediately after school in Cafeteria A. Come learn and spread self-defense tips from Westfield Police Department in honor of Sexual Assault Awareness Month. Anyone interested in attending should RSVP by completing the Google form that can be found by scanning the QR code on the flyers that have been shared with your teachers. No self-defense training is necessary. Any questions, please see Mrs. Legan. Ciao tutti. The Italian club will be meeting on Tuesday after school in room 257. If weather permits, they're going to be, they're going to be playing bachi. Please sign up with the form on Google Classroom. Did you know that more than 100,000 people are waiting for life-saving organ transplants? Did you know that one organ can save up to eight lives? Organ donation is considered a selfless act with great medical benefits to recipients. Want to know more about organ donation and how to make a life possible for people waiting for a second chance? Then join the Donate Life Club and use the Google Classroom code 4C2RXHI to join and find out more information on meetings and events. Any questions, please, Mrs. please see Mrs. De Silva. The next Blue Devil Travel Rehearsal will be on Monday. Please arrive at 6.55 p.m. so rehearsal can start at 7. The annual Mayhem Variety Show is coming up on May 6th. Mayhem is open to all WHS students to perform any sort of act they want, whether it's singing, stand-up comedy, playing an instrument, anything goes. If you'd like to participate in Mayhem, please join the Google Classroom code with code 4DXFCN5 and fill out the interest form that is posted. Pause for a cost. Uh, we're holding the last meeting of the year on Monday, April 17th at 2.45 in room 159. The club would like to thank WHS for helping donate other supp supplies for, to St. Hubert's Welfare Center last month. They were able to collect over a chunk of items to make the animals happy. Run to support the American Cancer Society. Download the app Charity Miles, then complete the sign-up process and join the team WHS SMAC. From there, sync your running apps with Charity Miles, log some runs, walks, and send family and friends for more donations. All proceeds will go to the American Cancer Society. The next meeting for the No Place for Hate Committee will take place on Tuesday immediately after school in the library. The Religion and Allyship, Race and Allyship, and LGBTQ Plus and Allyship Committees will be meeting to discuss upcoming events. New members are always welcome. Congratulations to the cast and crew of the WHS Theater Department on their 8th Montclair State University Foxy Award. Nominations for Outstanding Achievements in High School Theater. The fall production of Secret in the Wings received six nominations. Outstanding production of a dramatic play, outstanding achievement in it by an acting ensemble, outstanding achievement in live or original music, Anuel Barker, Bella Jarecki, Lucy St. Dennis, and Mr. Borzowski. Outstanding achievement in makeup design, Taylor Zinni. Outstanding achievements in the hair and wig design, Taylor Zinni, and outstanding achievements in the di direction of the play, Mr. Devlin. Additionally, last spring's production of Mamma Mia received two nominations, Outstanding Achievement by an Acting Ensemble and Outstanding Achievement in New Media and Special Effects, Matt DeFabio and the Tekken Design Team. Winners will be announced at a live in-person ceremony at Montclair State University on Tuesday, May 16th. Cor congratulations to everybody and break a leg. It's now time for sports with Michael Cerrotti. Mike? Good morning, WHS. I'm Michael Cerrotti and here's your BDTV sports update. Yesterday, the boys' golf team beat Governor Livingston 147 to 194, finishing with the top six overall scorers. The softball team took a 6-5 loss to ALJ, and the girls' lacrosse team fell to Oak Knoll 17-6. Today, four teams are in action at 4 o'clock, as the boys' volleyball team has a big home game against Wachung Hills, the boys' tennis team travels to New Providence, the softball team is home against Summit, and the baseball team plays at rival Scotch Plains. 
Tomorrow, the girls flag football team will have their season opener at 2 o'clock at Kent Place in the team's first game in program history. Then at 2.30, both lacrosse teams will hit the field as the boys are away against Ridgewood and the girls play Chatham at Keller. The boys tennis team will also compete in the Brian Bennett Invitational this weekend at Del Barton. Now it's time for the top three plays of the first week of the spring season. At number three, from behind the net, John McDonald passes it to the point to Cody Lamb, who fires it in for one of his four goals against Montclair. At number two, Ben Bucket Baker bumps the ball to Braden Abo, who sets it up to Jason Billings and he elevates and puts down a big spike against Hillside. And the number one play of the week. Aaron Doherty hits a ninth inning walk-off home run to beat Governor Livingston and give softball head coach Cheddar her 200th career win. That's all for today's sports report. Back to you, Enrique and Eddie. Thanks, Michael. If you'd like to submit an announcement to be read, please visit the BDTV page on the high school website. Follow us on Instagram at WHSBDTV. Have a great weekend, WHS, and go Blue Devils.